Mazuma Boxing here back with another video. Okay, um, I just watched this Fight Hype interview that uh, Floyd Mayweather had just done. Shout out to Fight Hype with these uh, exclusive videos. They've been on fire recently uh, regarding Mayweather interviews. And um, yeah, um, in the interview he has stated that he has the kind of power as to where if he was to fight Danny for his 50th fight, that they would be able to shut down Canelo versus Khan. Okay, man. Here's my thoughts on this. Um, I think he's absolutely right. Um, and this is going against the majority opinion that I've seen in the comments. Uh, people were stating that uh, Mayweather, you said uh, Robert Guerrero beat Danny. Why would you want to fight him? What the fuck? Shut the fuck up. I saw Shady Slim going in on Mayweather talking about nobody likes you, don't come back. <laughs> a little funny shit like that. It's been like a, a mix of emotions that have been shown since Fight Hype had released this interview. And um, like I said before, I agree with Mayweather. I believe he does have the... People don't understand how much star power Mayweather has, especially with that strong relationship he has at the MGM Grand. I genuinely believe if if he was to go inside the MGM Grand and say, hey, I want this fight uh, May 7th, single de Mayo weekend, I believe it'll happen, and it'll be on pay-per-view the same day as Canelo and Khan. Uh, they will either have to go against Mayweather for pay-per-view, or they will have to postpone their fight. Has, um, you know, Canelo has had issues with Mayweather regarding dates before. He felt as if he was more entitled to these Cinco de Mayo dates because he is uh, Mexican, which I completely understand. But what he doesn't seem to understand is that Mayweather is the bigger draw. He is the he is the former pound for pound king, and um, he has he he's able to do whatever he wants. He 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 just got it like that. Let's just say that. But um, I really believe that if Mayweather were to do this, it would cancel out Khan and Canelo. And see, this is what this is what I don't understand. People are complaining about this uh this Khan and Canelo fight saying that oh this fight what the fuck is this fight? This fight doesn't even make sense. How are they supposed to prepare for Triple G and um all this other shit. But then Mayweather comes up with a fight that that sounds more logical, makes more sense. And um it's like the perfect thing going against an undefeated fighter for your 50th fight to fight for a belt that was once yours at 147. That seems to make a lot more sense than uh, Canelo and Khan. But you, but you, the same people who are complaining about Canelo and Khan are supporting Canelo and Khan now that Mayweather is contemplating on whether he wants to fight that same week as them. Um, I don't particularly understand that, but you know it's okay. Um, what, what, I'm sorry, I'm just rambling. Um, so yeah, uh, Mayweather does Mayweather does have the power to do this. Um, and you know, the, the this interview alone just shows that Mayweather is coming back. Um, if you if you really believe that he's gonna stay retired, then then um, I think you're extremely wrong he, he it's like this nigga is oh the nigga acting like oj when oj put up remember when that nigga put out that book and he said even if i did kill her and, and, and kept on going with what he was saying this is exactly how mayweather's taking the approach he's saying if he's saying you know how oj said i didn't kill her but even if i did mayweather is, is saying something similar in terms of i don't have the urge to fight but for my 50th fight man just shut up just say you coming back that then you use that retirement you use your retirement thing as to try to get more pay per view buys for Birdo. It didn't particularly work because it can't the fans don't really care about you retiring, they care about the fight that's in front of them. Um, that's just how it is nowadays. And um Mayweather still managed to put out fifty five K to four hundred K uh pay per view buys. And uh you know, Andre Ward said that there wasn't an empty seat at the MGM Grand, so Mayweather did some Mayweather did show, uh, even if he was to fight someone who wasn't as deserving as the next guy, that he was still able to uh, do numbers in a way. Um, did more numbers than Lemieux and Triple G. I know that for sure. 
everybody was excited about that fight. But anyway, yeah, like I said, I think that I think that this fight makes a lot more sense than um than uh Amir Khan and Canelo. Uh Canelo is a fucking bitch for uh pulling this. I don't care what nobody says. Respect the Khan for taking this fight. Not everybody would do what Canelo would do what Khan did. There's a lot of people would do what Canelo would do, but not a lot of people would take on the fight like Khan did, moving up in weight because he claimed Danny ducked him. But you gotta respect that. You gotta respect uh Khan's heart it has been showcased throughout all of his fights, whether he was getting knocked out or whatever. He has shown his heart and he shows it outside the ring as well as he had taken this fight. Um but let me know what you guys think. Do you think Mayweather doesn't have it like that? Um just let me know what you guys think overall about this fight. This is Mizuma Boxing, and we out of here.